Uh, InDesign master pages are used to put repeating elements on document pages. Page numbering is best done using master pages. So we're going to quickly step through how to do that. First we open the Pages panel from Window Pages and choose the left facing master page. We're going to put um, page number in the lower left hand corner of the left pages and lower right hand corner of the right pages. On the left side we're also going to put the document title and on the right side we're going to put the author name. Um, this could be done uh, obviously you could put anything you want in there with the page number or you could just put the page number. Uh, first with the we're going to on the left facing master page select the text tool the T in the toolbar and draw a text frame in the appropriate location. This text frame can later be resized or moved with the direct selection tool the uh, black arrow on the toolbar. Now we're going to go to with the T tool, text tool still selected, go to type, insert special character, markers, current page number, which you see inserts the letter A into the text frame. This stands as a placeholder or symbol for the current page number. Uh, I'm going to zoom in on this area so you can see it better by choosing the zoom tool, the magnifying glass on the toolbar and drawing a marquee around the area that I want to see. See how that zooms it in so it's much bigger? Uh, document title. So I typed in document title. Then I'm going to click on the left facing page number paragraph style that I prepared to format the text. See now it's bold faced and it's an Adobe Kazlon Pro font size 10 point. Now we need to go over to the right facing master page. I'm just going to use the scroll bar to do that. And again with the text tool draw a text frame in the appropriate area which could be resized later if we wanted to. And then I'm going to type in author name, which in this case is my name, a space, and then go to type, insert special character, markers, current page number. And you see it again inserts an A. By the way, the A is because this is the A master. If we were on a B master, then it would insert a B. And note on the pages panel that A is applied to each of the pages in the document. Uh, you can change that under by pulling down the menu on the pages panel and choosing apply master to pages and selecting the master that you want to apply to the pages or selecting none if you didn't want to apply it and then setting a page range in the um, in the in the uh, menu in the dialog box okay that's all there is to it now let's look at the document pages and we should see that the um, each page has on the right side, right right facing page has my name and the page number and the left facing pages have the page number and document title. Oh and we didn't apply the paragraph style correct paragraph style to the right hand page. So select get into the text and click on the right facing page number and you see this uh, applies the right facing paragraph style to the text and now all the right facing page numbers are also formatted correctly. Uh, and that's all there is to it. Then you save your document, file, save as and I'm going to save it as the um, page numbering file and that's all there is to it. Thank you very much.